Los Angeles CIO Steve Renniker says he'll ask technology companies this month for ideas on how to blanket his city with a combined fiber and wireless network. I spoke to Renniker about the project, known as the LA Community Broadband Network, at our Beyond the Beltway conference in March. We have Mayor Garcetti, who from an economic development standpoint, wants to see fiber to every residence and every business. And then we have uh, Councilman Blumenfeld, who is in charge of our Innovation Technology Committee. And he's trying to take a look at the visitor and digital inclusion aspects. So he's pushing for a wireless uh, network inside the city. And so we're trying to combine the two of those efforts so that we could have a fiber attached wireless network throughout the city, leveraging the assets that the city owns and trying to provide gigabit speeds on a paid basis, but also a free slower speed uh, component for the 36% of the Angelinos in Los Angeles that don't have access to broadband or a computer at home. He's already written an RFP for the network, but Renneker says he'll first issue an RFI to gauge vendor interest in linking the broadband project with broader plans for city IT modernization. We have a strategic initiative that's going on, taking a look at privatization of a number of our IT services. So we're, we're looking at putting those in the RP and say, is there any interest from anybody that wants to respond to the broadband initiative to manage a cloud computing center, to manage the city's data network, uh, maybe even manage a new voice network for the city, uh, those kinds of things. So we've put a number of those in there to really mesh up about a hundred uh, about about $1 billion worth of potential services over the next 10 years. The city also wants to understand how evolving LTE technology fits into the broadband project and to ensure that the new network supports the LA School District's plan to give iPads to 650,000 students. Look for more coverage on this issue at GovTech.com.